You can see the bat house is off in the distance, but I really like that they have this little warning here for the UF community. Enjoy the bats, but stay responsible to help avoid spread of COVID-19. Limit groups to no more than 10. Well, it's just Jessica and I, and who knows? We might be the only ones here tonight. For Jessica's birthday this year, we planned on spending it in Austin, Texas, mainly so Jessica can see the bats. Well, because of COVID-19, that didn't happen. So tonight, we are in Gainesville, Florida, looking at these bat houses. Tonight at sunset, bats will fly, and we will be here to watch them. Wherever I come, bad luck is coming my way. Wherever I go, hard luck is that it stays. Good luck never stays a day. A bad luck's always coming my way. It is extremely hot out and Jessica has her umbrella. Are you ready for the bats tonight? I'm ready for them now. For now? Are you ready for them now? Yeah. It, I'm early. It's going to be a little bit late. Yeah. Hopefully we're going to be the only people here tonight. Oh, this is going to be cool. Welcome to the University of Florida Bat House and Bat Barn. There they are right there. How freaking cool. Some of the things that I'm standing here reading is kind of impressive. For instance, it says bats may swoop near those observing the emergence to eat insects attracted to the carbon dioxide in human breath. Maybe we should hold our breath, but check this out. Facts about this colony, estimated population, 400,000 as of April 2013 and growing. Capacity of each barn, 750,000. That is insane. Please do not disturb. The occupants of this bat house comprise one of the largest known colonies of, yes, Mexican free-tailed bats in the southeastern United States. These insect-eating flying mammals are designated, well, here in Florida, if I'm not mistaken, bats are endangered species, so you can't even mess with them. So don't Disturb. Do not disturb. Important notice. Oh yeah, and this is probably important. Please avoid standing directly under the house, any loud noises, and touching any grounded bat if they are to fall on the ground. Oh man. So it says to be quiet, but they also have this path that walks over to this garden that they have designated. But we realized that we can probably walk up to the fence and look up inside one of these without really getting in trouble. So let's get close. We have to be quiet. Whoop. Fell into a hole. You can hear them. That's crazy cool. You can actually hear the bats. Can you hear them, Jessica? Cool, right? Chirp, chirp, chirp. Chirp, chirp, chirp. We're what? 30 yards from the houses? This is going to be insane. But it doesn't happen until later on tonight. So, did you hear that? That's a dragonfly. Or is that a cicada? I don't know. It's something weird happening, but we have some time to kill. So let's go and try to find some gators because on the opposite side of the street, there's a lake called Lake Alice. I wish it was called Lake Placid. And they have been known to see gators in the wild. Can't get too close because I don't think we're gonna be fast enough to outrun them if it comes down to that. At first glance into the water, not seeing anything, but there's a sign right there, no fishing, danger, alligators and snakes in area. Stay away from the water, do not feed the wildlife. But this is how close we are. I mean, look at this. Reminds me of that boat trip we took. Crazy, right? Yeah, yeah for the uh, Creature from the Black Lagoon filming locations. Yeah, Be careful, baby. I keep looking out into the water to see if I can see 
little beady eyes looking out at us. But nothing. You know, we might not see some alligators, but I could really go for Betty White coming up to us. That was a Lake Placid reference, if you didn't catch it. stay 20 feet away but let's put a bench right here that's not 20 feet there's another sign to the left of your screen warning people to stay out of the water away from the water but I'm looking I'm not seeing anything I want to see a gator how crappy would it be if a gator just kind of jumped out and like bit the camera I would scream like a little girl and run, kind of like whenever birds attack. Well, birds never really attack, they just fly me near, fly near me and then I kind of lose it. But just for a moment, just take in how beautiful that is. Where's Jessica going? Hey Jessica, where are you going? All right Jessica, waiting and hoping that the rain holds off. Are you excited to see the bats? I am, but it's almost kind of fitting that it should be raining because, you know, something always happens, but you just roll with the punches and you enjoy it. The thunder in the background is a nice touch. It's kind of a nice touch because the skies look gorgeous right now. Oh, yeah. And the, the sunlight peeking through and all that, so very excited. Look at that. It's a good day it's nice and for these puppies to come out. They're like diving above the top of the trees. They look like little bugs. There's so many. We decided to move. My babies. Still staying away from everybody else, but you get a better shot. The light, look at that. Yeah. That's magnificent. They're so small. They're so tiny. They just keep coming and coming and coming. Wow. It's almost like you can just reach out and touch them. <laughs> Surprised Jessica doesn't have her hat off I'm trying to catch one. <laughs> you guys can't see it, but in the darkness below the house, I'm sorry, houses, swarming. you just see these swarming shadows. Crazy. It's just insane. It's like a never ending supply of bats. I wish I had a never ending supply of bats. <laughs> but you can't see it that well, but you have to look. There's another stream of bats on the other side of the field right there. Yeah. 
beautiful. Eating all the mosquitoes. Oh, they're so cute. They're so small. <laughs> So all the bats have flown out for the evening. There might be one or two left, but they're all gone. And Jessica was just saying that this kind of reminds her of midsummer, and I have to agree. With that, have a good night. Is that your bat sound? Yeah. I love you. Wherever I come, I'm in love. Just come my way. Wherever I go, hard luck. Is that in state? Good luck never stays a day. A bad luck's always coming my way. 